What the heck is a great way to store your clamps? Hola woodworkers, Paul Carlson here, small workshop guy. On this wall here, I have a piece of plywood and then I have a lot of different braces that kind of stick out and are angled down so that the clamps can go in between those braces and not fall down and, and you space those out appropriately. There's 4,000 different videos about how to do those. Well, here's an idea I have for you. You've run out of wall space, and I certainly sort of feel like I've done that, And I, but I got more clamps I want to store. So what I did was I took some three-quarter inch pipe from Home Depot and some flanges for the end, and I screwed those flanges into the studs. I would make sure you find studs if you're going to do this and then put a pipe all the way across the garage, or in my case, I went part way across and then had a, a little elbow and then went up to the ceiling uh, with another flange. Now, I've got this pipe up here at just the right height. Make sure you put it at the right height so that you can put a lot of 24 inch clamps. I build a lot of cabinets and stuff, so these are the perfect size for me. And uh, you can store them up there and still walk under them and not hit your head on them. Now you can do a whole bunch of storage coming out this way. How many do I have here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. 16 claps right there. Always remember, you can't stop the waves, but you can learn to surf. I hope you like this series of what the heck is, short, designed for beginners. Give me a like, give me a comment, give me a subscription, and I'll share more little tips with you in the future. Small Workshop Guy, signing off.